And welcome to the super fun, awesome, happy time panel show. My name is Gabor. Hey, welcome. I'm Alex. And? And? We've got some modulation. Modulation? Today from the hot tone. Hot tone? Yes. <laughs> yes. Yes. Uh, big thank you to Scott and Reese at Nice Toys Imports here in Australia. <coughs> We've got the mod binary, or mm. binary mod. I'm not sure which way it is, but it's a hot tone binary series, and this is the mod. Hey, before we go on, if you hit like and subscribe on the channel, and a thumbs up on the video is always appreciated. Um, yeah, let us know what you think about this in the comments below. Um, if you've got one already, um, how's it going? All that kind of stuff. And um, yeah, if you'd hit the notification bell, and we'll send you a message next time the video's up. He will personally send you one, a letter. Well, I will uh, handwritten. fax you. Hand, fax you a handwritten letter. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so that's something to look forward to. Okay, so uh, the binary. So basically, mm. it's a rather small footprint. It's like MXR pedal size. Yeah. Um, 10 presets, I believe. I mean, this is sort of a general overview kind of thing now. Uh, so you can store a bunch of presets. We've got stereo out, so we're plugged in in stereo. We actually got two uh, UAD... Marshall Plexi emulations. What he said. Just so it's exactly the same each side, so you can hear all the modulation in stereo. Yeah, and there's an expression pedal in as well. We may or may not hook up an expression pedal to that later. See if you can listen to it either on a laptop or something with headphones or better speakers so you can hear the stereo. The stereo image. You won't get that off your phone or... Because there's some there's some cool stereo images yeah. on it. So basically you've got two buttons, you've got an on and off switch that the, the knobs light up once it's on. Uh, this one is a switch you can scroll between the presets. You've got A, 1 to 5, and then if you push both buttons it goes to B and you've got 1 to 5. Hmm. Which is what makes me think that there may be 10 presets. 5 plus 5 is um, oh, 10. Uh, but then this button, if you this, you know, if you hold it in, must be on when it's on. It turns into tap function, so you can yep. see that light light up, and then you can tap fast, tap slowly. Tap um, till your heart's just heart's content. Yes, yes, mm. one of one of them. So let's start off A one. Uh, so there's, I believe there are. Let me get my little cheat sheet. Twenty four different effects on it. There's different choruses. Detunes, flanges, tremolos, phasers, rotary sounds, vibratos, and auto wires, and lo-fi. Mm. So shall we go through a few? So sure, yeah, yeah. Let's check out the presets. Eh? Clean sound uh, on this blue guitar through the amp sim thing stuff sounds yep. actually. So that's the overall effect. Yeah. Uh, one of the other cool things actually about it is, so you've got the screen, I don't know how good you can read it. It's a pretty cool little screen actually, pretty, pretty high res little screen. Mm. But once you turn one of these things, it actually tells you what you're doing. So you've got low cut, that's a low cut, that's a high cut, because you've got uh, rate and depth, which is kind of the same for everything, but then you've got a parameter A and parameter B, which is different for different effects. But as you turn it, it actually t tells you what it what it is yeah
So the first one was the Grand Chorus, based on the legendary Green Ensemble Chorus in Chorus Mode. Mm. Cryptic. Uh, the second one is the Sky Chorus, based on the Orion SCH-1 Stereo Chorus. Uh, which almost like on with everything on full, almost has like a. It's like almost ring modulator ish. Yeah, sort of from the future in the 60s. <laughs> yeah. So I should mention that, so you've got a plus and minus button here. So with yeah. this, you actually scroll through the different effects. So if I go up again, next one's a tiny chorus, which is based on the electroharmonic small clone. Lovely. The next one is a 3D chorus, producing multi-dimensional chorus with independent depth control over left, center, and right sound channels. So you've got this one, it should say it here, this one is the left depth, right depth, and center depth, and that is the rate of it. So let's turn left and right off and just have the center on full and the right sort of in the middle. Bigged a bit yeah. once you brought in the left and right. It's pretty cool. So it's somewhat reminiscent of something that may, may be above Alex's head back there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, that's cool. That sounds pretty. That sounds pretty cool, actually. Uh, and it's, um, it doesn't get like it's not going CC course, but it has kind of very cool like stereo spread effect in the room. Yeah. yeah. Mm. So the next one is a stereo chorus producing magical stereo chorus with speed control. Um, oh, and parameter A is the chorus dimension spread separation. Yeah, and then you've got um, no, spread separation. that's a spread separation. So let's keep let's start the spread separation tight. Okay. And then let's spread it apart more. <laughs> Lush and spread. Okay, <laughs> next one. Whew. Bass chorus. Phrasing boom. Based on the world's first bass chorus pedal. Do we want to bother with the bass chorus? Just quickly play. Okay. Sure. I'll play low strings. <laughs> That's a detune, the next one. Oh yeah, okay. Teach yeah, that's like on a whammy. Mm. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. 
Oh no, they found us. From this area, is area so 31. This is a normal flanger, or flanger if you're Australia, in Australia. Uh, and it sounds suchly. <laughs> Tremolo flanger. So this is where you have a so flanger cool. in the tremolo. I mean, it's... tremolo in the flanger. Or yeah. whichever way we look at it, really. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of interesting having the dual modulation really going cool. on. I think it's like a really low gain fuzz. That would be hip. As the kids would say. As uh, Nana says. Yeah. Uh, bass flanger, next really one. I like that one. Bass flanger. Wow. Hang on, hang on. Flangery, okay. Just leaves the bottom end open. Yeah. 90s phaser, based on an MXR phase 90. and gooey to feel like under the fingers it's cool. uh, next one green phaser based on a legendary two knot green phaser with sharp phasing effect sharp phasing we'll see about that Phase. Ah, producing a special phase effect on combined smooth tremolo, mono output, pan, stereo output variations. Ah, so now we've got a. That's fun. That's kind of cool. So we've got the tremolo depth or pan depth and rates. Yeah. And the phaser depth and rate. So we should go one really slow, one fast. Okay, yeah. the pan really slow. That's Fantastic. cool. That sounds really cool. Headphones, people. Headphones. Buy it for that.
Oh yeah, sure, sure, why not? Because that's a cool sound. So this is the Parts Master Caster Blaster, Caster Master Blaster, Caster Blaster. Video of it here. Try that one. Oh. Because yeah, yeah, yeah. The big girl. <sighs> Barry. <laughs> Big girl called Barry. Barry the big girl. That, that makes okay, sense. Eastwood Guitars. Big thank you to Michael at Eastwood Guitars Australia. Side, uh, uh, side Jack Deluxe uh, Baritone, which sounds suchly. <laughs> Lovely. That's a cool sound, just for that. It's groovy, yeah. Uh, okay, uh, next, where do we go from here? Helicopter tremolo. Mm. Based on a Demeter, Demeter, Demeter? Yeah, is it? The the emitter <laughs> tremolo tremulator. <laughs> uh, is that stereo effect as well? That's stereo. Tarantino-y. Yes. It's cool. Uh, yes, it's on the Tarantino later. That's what it's based oh, on. Fantastic. Okay, next one. Opto tremolo uh, simulates classic pulsing tremolo effect on the on sixties American amps. Maybe.
Well, they sound lovely. The stereo effects are great. That's pretty cool. Definitely listen to it with headphones and good speakers. Um, let, me, let, me, let me have a quick go. I mean, we don't have a huge amount of time, but let me have a quick go. Quick Barry run. Give ba Baz a run. <laughs> Spence. I like that. The stereo effects are great. Okay, back to Dogman. I mean, you. Dogman. Uh, where are we now? Bias Tremolo. Same deal, but British amps. That's square as you. That's as square as it gets, isn't it? That's square as you, man. Hey, how are you always? This control is the bias control, so it oh. changes the uh, waveform. Biasing. Yeah. A little less square to a little more square. <laughs> <laughs> but, um. Lush Roto, based on a Shine Univibe. Ah, something yes I went to the mini roto based on yes. a voodoo lab micro vibe yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow
So this is the grand vibrato, the grand vibrato. Based on a legendary green ensemble chorus, cryptic, in vibrato mode. vibrato based on a legendary blue big black donkey based vibrato pedal <laughs> Sweep up and down. Lots of ducky, quite quacky sounds. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, sure. It's quacky like a duck. Quack. Yes, yes. Okay, and with this now you can um, you can see you can go up or down. So you can go the, the sweep can go up or can go down. <laughs> It's like that cocked wire thing. Yeah. Like nasally filter. <laughs> That's a good start. Auto wire. Fully controllable bandpass filter with variable auto wire effects. Now we get to the good ones. Do we? Ring modulator. <laughs> oh, that's weird. You play the notes up and it goes down. You've got a coarse tune and a fine tune. Now, if you can assign that to the expression pedal, which you can, yeah. that's cool, because then you can do these things. You can do the... Or... Every good household needs one of those. I never know what to do with that. Once again. I just don't understand. Uh, let, let me let me do some baritone ring modulator. Oh wow, I can't wait for this. Barry. Thank 
I don't know if it likes the l really low notes. Um, yeah, it's so close to computer game music. Yeah. And then lastly, we have the lo-fi. Sure. Bit crushing sample reducing effect. I'll play a major seven chord. Almost. <laughs> Shosh, because you've got a high cut on it as well. Yeah. High cut and low cut. So assigning a high cut to the expression pattern, for example, which you can. Yeah, pretty fun. That could be interesting because then you do that. Crazy town. My Of Super Mario. Yeah. That's when the world exploded. Yeah. Um, yeah, and then I mean, you find the lo fi sound that you like for your next gig, Alex, and then you press save. Save to A1. Save to A1, and then you can always record it whenever you want. Let's have a quick, should we quickly? Let's look at the presets it came with, because we haven't sure. touched any of it. This is just the presets. <laughs> Yes, oh, absolutely, everything does. Um, <laughs> a job and a master has got one of them on his, uh, oh. just for that sound, on his journey. Right now. Um, <laughs> so, and, and basically, you can put an expression pedal in, you've got the global settings, you can go to global settings, whether you have um, mono or stereo input, input mode, you can set uh, which one of these, um, the target, <coughs> Bless you. for your sneezes. Um, uh, you could set the range, minimum, maximum range of the expression pedal. 
uh, and things. calibrate the expression pedal, uh, and that's sort of the global parameters. And you've got the presets on it. I think for the price and for the size, mm. there's some really good sounds on it. Very cool. Uh, there's a delay we're going to do next. Yes. So stay tuned for that. Stay tuned. One. Stay by a computer until In, um, two days from now when the next video comes out. <laughs> until you instruct it. Hey, um, yeah, let us know what you think. If you got one of these, um, see how it's going. Comments below. And while you're there, there's links to Instagram, Facebook, MySpace, Fax Machine, Smoke Signals, and Pigeons. You can contact us through. I thought all the lot, pigeons left. All those. <laughs> yeah, the smoke scared them off. Hey, um, once again, if you did like and subscribe. The comedy starlings of Alex. If you want more Alex comedy, uh, leave comments below too. We might do just a whole day of stand up comedy routines of yours. Mm, I might sit down for that one. Yeah. So, yeah. Okay, sit down comedy routine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, thanks for hanging out. That might be our cue. Yes. See you next time. Bye. Good on you.